Hey, what's going on, my dudes? My name is Bleeker, and welcome to an adventure of a lifetime, a Minecraft adventure map by Mick underscore five, or Mick five, or Mick, or fives? Eh? We'll go with, we'll go with Mick. So, a brand new adventure map by Mick five, only coming out... Tomorrow or the next day, I think. So I have, um, I was granted early access because I had to do, uh, I had to do some trailer and bug testing. But this should be the full release version just a day or two early. Um, starting off here, um, there's a lot of different signage and things in here to uh, get set up for the map. Uh, I've already done all the pre-work, so we're actually ready to start the map. Now, something really cool specifically about this map is that it was actually fully voice acted. So there is, so there was actually voice actors involved and there's tons of different uh, dialogues and things that we'll get throughout the map. So the goal of this, start the map, finish the map. Um, we're not going to be side questing too much in this. This is just a walkthrough of what you need to get through the map. Outside adventuring and exploration, that's up to you guys to do. So without ado... Uh, you're starting the map without doing a quick tutorial first. If you wish to start without doing it, press the button again. There we go. Of a Created by Mick Something happens that changes your life forever. And this is where your story begins. Boy, you, prisoner, one, four, five, wake up. Prisoner, one, four, five. should wake you rude that's it look down here prisoner today's your lucky day you have been given a pardon you are free to go prisoner hold on i will open the cage you're free to go prisoner Mind your step. And what a lovely step it is. I shall pay it much mind. Thank you, sir. Uh, um, cool. So, I am a... Prisoner, I am released. On your way, 145. And don't get into any more trouble. Yeah, 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 chill. I've only been here 15 seconds. I couldn't possibly have done anything in that time. Using other exit. Neat. Stay out of trouble, citizen. But I haven't done anything yet. Make sure to pick up your items from the office first. Yes, 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 that's fine. That's all well and good. Actually, just going to there we go that's a little better maybe yeah let's bottom it out at 30. all right prisoner follow me okay to the office all right and get your belongings okay we can do that we can totally do that Go inside 
inside and pick up your items. Then you're free to go. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. That's so cool. One, four, five. As there is no evidence to murder, or murder weapon recovered. Correct. Is that the body in your house? Yeah. You have no choice but to let you go. Ooh, shucks. I still don't know if I believe that you are innocent. Yeah. The dead guard was found in your house after all. Circumstantial. Anyway, I will get your clothes and your <laughs> house key. Bless you, sir. Bless you. Oh, yeah. How can I prove that I that I really am innocent? To prove your innocence, you will need to find evidence on the one who committed the crime or recover the murder weapon. Goodbye. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Have have day. Oh, uh, all right. Time to go prove my innocence. The first thing I should do is go back over the bridge and go home. No, the first thing I should do is put pants on. I don't want to get a felony for public indecency. Alright, so... Uh, apparently I killed someone. I don't recall killing somebody. But I, I murdered somebody, I guess. But, you know, these, these things do happen. Uh, house one... Oh, no, I'm not here to hurt you. I never committed that murder. I, I was just released. I'm innocent. I couldn't find enough evidence. I thought you had escaped and come here to kill me. I couldn't stop shaking. I, I would never murder anyone, allegedly. And if I was set free, and I was set free, I will find out who set me up, even if it means leaving here and traveling far across well, the lands. It sounds like you're going on a huge adventure. Go on. Take the coins from my drawers upstairs. Oh. It's the least I can do. Well, good luck. Oh, I'm going to do a lot more than take the coins out of your upstairs. And I worry, wouldn't worry about me killing you. Time has already got your number. Alright, so next step, let's let's actually go home. Home. Oh, door. Aha, door key. It looks like the guards removed the body. They could have cleaned all the blood. Yes, they could have. Um, I should stock up on food and then go and talk to all the villagers as I need to find some clues to prove I am innocent. Yes, I'm totally innocent. No need for suspicion here. Completely innocent. I could never hurt a fly. Or could I? You know, the jury's still... Oh, alright. Time to get some information. I should leave no stone unturned. Correct. No stone unturned. Um... Uh... What about trees? Trees unturned? Eh... All right, so first thing we'll do, we'll kind of start over here and work our way in deeper into town. Um, I personally recommend kind of exploring around a little bit because a lot of the supplies that I used throughout the rest of my adventure when I was playtesting, I, I, got, I got here in town. I'm actually going to do a little bit of additional exploration on top of what I did when, uh, when playtesting. Oh, good ammo something that i ran out of quite quite quickly in in this game uh, good more more ammo that's very good uh the gun in here you actually need oh look at all that 40 rounds i didn't even know this was back here that's that's quite excellent actually i'm very pleased to have gone back here Okay, so this is a windmill. You can tell that by the way it mills 
Wind. Nailed it. Uh, oh, oh, uh, the money. Oops. Money and subsequent broken ankles. Um, hey. Oh, I never believed you would kill anybody. After all, I've known you since you were a baby. Now, if you're going to look for answers, you will need to venture beyond this village, out into the dangerous world, and you will need a weapon to protect yourself. You should go to the mayor's house and make sure you ask around town for a sword. Someone might have one. Oh, oh. Well, good luck. Is it just me, or did that guy sound like, uh, um... Fat Bastard from Austin Powers? I swear he did. Come on. So I'm, I'm gonna kind of inspect the, the outer edges here of the, of the map. Of this uh, space we've got to find for town. Just, uh, just to sp uh, scope out, see if there's something. Oh, hello. That's a hole. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. I did. I didn't adventure quite this this hard when I when I did the when I did the playthroughs. So this is a lot of good stuff in here. Actually, it looks like there's something up there. I'm quite intrigued now. I know we're getting away from our objective, but. I, I'm I, I know we're getting away from our objective of the mayor's house, but I'm I'm keen to explore this area real quick. Oh, nice, very nice. Okay, <laughs> and then aha! Oh, tight. And kneecaps. Nice. All right, now, dude, that, that's actually pretty tight. I didn't realize that was back there. Okay, all right. So we're going to go to the guard shack. We're going to explore out from there. All right, so this is a watchtower. So the guard shack is, like, right there. Okay, yeah, this is a good spot. Got all kinds of blue stands here. There's got to be something. Maybe not. Ah, darn. If they find me, I'm leaving this town. If they're out of luck, if there's a murder in this town, the mayor has lost the place. And now, no one can come or go. Ah. Yeah. Darn. Hello. Well... I don't know if you've noticed with your recent predicament, being locked up and all that, but the mayor hasn't been seen by anybody lately. Apparently he is sick. Strange how he found ill straight after the murder happened at your house. Anyway, you should remember to ask around the town. You still have friends in this town, although there are some who still think you're guilty. And they might be correct. <laughs> Alright, so then... Guard shack, right here. So then we'll inspect the other windmill. Windmill number two. Did I already inspect windmill number two? Ow. Oh, hey, that's from... Uh, that picture is from Journey for the Enchanted Crest RPG, another one of mixed maps. Aha! Generic. Come on, there we go, buddy. Come on, keep going. Noise. Noise, noise, noise. Excellent. Uh, okay. Oh! That actually worked! I am the greatest Minecraft player ever. <clears throat> okay, house number three. 
Hello. Ow. My head. I won't be going back in there. Indeed. Uh, next house. Do you see the shit out there? Uh, it's said yes. to be haunted. Oh. But I bet it's just a story to stop anyone from going on board because I heard there's a map that leads to a treasure room there. Does it now? Oh. That's fascinating, actually. We'll, we'll have to go check that out. And then later. We'll, we'll, we'll check it out later. First things first, I need to, I need to get to the mayor's house. Um, let's see here, house number five. Hello. You know, a few days ago, before uh -huh. the murder took place, I, I yeah. saw a strange person hanging around near your house. Oh. I have never seen them before, but now they are nowhere to be seen. Oh. I have always believed you innocent. Oh. Uh, but some folks in this town still believe you are guilty. If you're going to track down the culprit, then you'll probably need to leave this town. But you'll need to see the mayor in House 11 for the key to exit the town first. Okay. All right. Yeah. I can, I can, I can see about doing that. You know what? I will do that here in a couple of short stops. Uh, let's see, is there anything good in here? Hello, Mayor. Hello. I haven't heard of Forest Stranger in a while. Oh. I saw them fleeing towards Lantern Forest. No. I bet that you committed the murder in your house. Nope, it was me. You're innocent after all. Am I? Since the mayor locked the gate to stop the murder, he has not left his house. Mm. I can't say he is guilty, but I think there is more to it than that. <laughs> Possibly. But no, I'll I'll own up to it. Howdy. Oh no! It's the great great ah! eh. Mayor's house this way. Huzzah! Now we are getting somewhere. As I immediately go the opposite direction. Aha! Dinero. Eh. Okay, um. Just went there. That's where the kid ran in. Um. Uh, Alright, I think, I think we're ready to visit uh, the mayor's house. Um. Me? Oh, it's me. I am here to see the mayor. Um, uh, uh yes, yes. Uh, 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 the mayor is quite sick at the moment. Uh, uh, come back in a month. A month? Oh. Hey, over here. Oh, yeah, over there. Yeah. Oh, money. I'm easily amused by material things. Hello. I was the one who negotiated your release from prison. Oh, thank you. Even though the guards had no evidence on you, oh, yeah. you were going to leave your mayor to rot. Damn. But I used my influence to have you released. I am the mayor's advisor, or should I say wise. You see, just after the murder happened in your house, the mayor was kidnapped. I saw the mayor whole napped. thing, but couldn't do anything. There were too many of them. I don't know who is living in the mayor's house now, but it definitely isn't the mayor. So now I need your help. Since I helped you, I task you with finding the mayor's whereabouts. And in your process, you may find the killers and clear your name as well. On the big ship here is a map to the treasure. You will need it. If you are to complete this quest, take these ladders and you will see a spot you can place these ladders on. The other side of the ship. Don't get a fright from the ghost that appears. It is just an illusion that the mayor set up to stop anyone trying to take the map. Once you have used the map to find the treasure, 
I will meet up with you. Now go, and good luck. Oh, I received three ladders. Excellent. Well, I, I, I guess I better go inspect the, the ghost ship. Or the, the not ghost ship. Moderately ghost ship? It doesn't matter. Noise. Well, I suppose. Okay. Below gate. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Nope. God, I don't have any super underwater breathing abilities. Okay, so. Alright, one. Oh, come on. Two, three. And nailed it. Ooh, ghost ship. So, you know, it's just a, it's a tad too spooky for me. Here, we can get a map. A map to a treasure. Once again, is there anything of value down here? Yes. Uh, okay, yep, that's all well and good. Yep. Anything else? Oh, oh, nice. Honestly, these health pots are going to come in handy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Another cannonball. Actually, did I go in here? Maybe. I don't remember if I went in here or not, but hey, free ammo. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's so cool. Maybe? It's gonna be a strong maybe for me, dog. Okay, map. Just raid the captain's booty. Okay, so the map. Map number 35 and a rusty shovel. So I am here on this ship. The treasure chest is over here. So we're going to take this rusty shovel and we're going to go unbury a treasure chest. It's another swashbuckling adventure here. There we go. Treasure map leads me here to line marks the spot, I suppose. Nice, so now I have the pirate's blade. It's a beginner blade, still looks sharp, made from hard oak, and will never break. So this is where we're going to leave off our ad adventure of a lifetime for now. When we come back next time, I guess we'll accomplish more things. But until then, guys, this has been Bleaker. Be seeing ya.